lady likes bad boys. But she doesn't really want a bad boy. She no. only wants a bad boy in a cage. No, I'm trying not to give anything away, plus I've had Botox, so you can never tell how I feel. Hello. Hello! I'm Catherine. I'm Ethan. And we're back, baby. It's season two. Did you notice we're in a new studio? Catherine's been doing some home improvements. Yeah, I've been inspired by a lot of decorating programs and your face. Yeah, it looks really... Inspired me. Quite something. But we're actually here today because Sky Q have asked us to come talk about loads of the things that we love to watch and listen to. That's right, we're going to be answering some questions and playing a whole load of games. And of course, everything we do will be decided by the mighty Q cards. Roll the tiles! Are you ready for the first one? Indeed. Okay. Name one character in a show you would bring back to life. Ooh, so this one is big. It's Iron Man. He went out a hero, but he deserves better than that. This is difficult for me because I did not know he was deceased. Oh, oh I'm sorry to break the news to you. Um, he was a philanthropist. I'm sorry for your loss. How did he die? Oh, it was a great epic battle. Um, it was really something. Maybe give it a watch. And you want him to come back? Absolutely. I suppose I would bring back Elsa and Anna's parents from Frozen, because okay. they died at sea. Aww. And you know in Disney films, a lot of times it's a writer's shorthand for a coming of age, mm. as they remove the parents. Oh. Bambi, Nemo. Oh, true, you're not wrong. Elsa and Anna, just let them have their parents. Okay, I could agree with that. <sighs> but, oh, oh, it went through the window. Yeah. <laughs> Name? a TV show or film that you are currently obsessed with. Love After Lockup has taken over my life. It's all that I care about. It is the greatest show ever, and it's on TLC. It's about people who write letters to an incarcerated person, so an inmate, and they develop this relationship while someone's incarcerated, and then that person gets out, and all of a sudden the power structures change. So when are we gonna start planning our uh, vows? As soon as you want, man. I don't know if you thought of what you want to include. Any ideas hmm. about how much you love me and how happy I make you and how we're going to be together forever? They get out. They've got a lovely lady waiting for them. But the lady likes bad boys. But she doesn't really want a bad boy. She no. only wants a bad boy in a cage. She wants the caged bad boy. They're back in usually within weeks. I was going to say, or they think, you know what? Get me, <laughs> get me back well, in. that's what happens. Because the incarcerated person is like, do you know what? I had more freedom in jail. Like, you're the warden and I don't like it. And then they just go back to be with their friends and play video games. I like me a comedy. Dave Chappelle on Netflix. He's got some good specials on there. He has. Kevin Hart specials. I like those too. Yeah. I've met Kevin Hart before, so I've got that bond with him just through the screen, you know? Anyone else with the Netflix specials that you like watching? Um, Jack Whitehall's latest one was really good. Yeah. Really like that one. Mm. Any more? Yours. Oh. Yours is... Yours is yeah. My favorite one. Save the best for last. Exactly, you know. Sky Q card says, ooh, props. You have 45 seconds to rate these rom-coms in order of favorite. These rom-coms? Wow, right, here we go. <laughs> mean Girls, very good, but not my favorite, so I'm gonna place it here. Big Fat Greek Wedding, in and around the same area, maybe I'll have a reshuffle. Cinderella, no, not for me. Bridget Jones's Diary, Ah. Uh. it's all right. How to Lose a Guy in 10 Days. No, Ooh. we'll go below. Love Actually, now we're talking. Boom, up there. Isn't it romantic? Not Scooby, mate. That <laughs> one can go down there. And the map of tiny perfect things. Oh, you did it! Right on 45 seconds, well done. Did that scare you? The beep did, yes. It's a clear winner for me. Love Actually. Love Actually. Okay. Then we've got some decent ones. Yeah. Mid-tier, uh -huh. they'll do the job. And then these lot, oh, <gasps> oh. what do you reckon? Well, Cinderella, is it a rom-com? Exactly, that's what I was thinking, that's why it's... Do you know what? <laughs> what you've gathered here is that Love Actually <laughs> is the best one from the list. Oh, no. <laughs> it's time for the Q charts. Hello, thank you. Welcome to the Q charts. Ethan, spin the wheel and use the props behind you to help me guess the TV show, film, or song that it's landed on. You have 90 seconds to win as many points as possible. Three, two, one, go. Right, here we go. First spin. It's a big spin. Ooh. Okay. Ouch. Ouch. Pouch. Kangaroos. 
Sound like ouch? It's a plaster. Plaster. Task. Why don't you just write the name of the show? Is it Taskmaster? <laughs> I've been on Taskmaster. Yes, there you Ethan. go. Boom. You just point at me. I won Taskmaster thanks, twice. Thanks, thanks. Don't worry. No, that, we've done Taskmaster. it Taskmaster. <laughs> Big six o'clock. Six times. Six seconds. Six minutes. Till midnight. Six minutes till midnight. Boom. Love yes. that. Well Lovely. done. Well done. A lot of numbers. Whoa, whoa, whoa. All right. This is like an episode of Taskmaster now. <laughs> okay, um, uh, the <laughs> Superman, American, t Captain America, red face. Red, oh, um, the Marvel film, the Marvel film with the guy with the red face. WandaVision, WandaVision. They go in like, t I don't understand what happens, why they're in all the different eras of time, but it looks good. You fly. No flight list. America, you are going, breaking America, coming to America. Uh, um, the mm, flight, flight attendant, the flight attendant. Yeah! Is that awesome? Very yes. good acting, Ethan. <laughs> yes! Boom! <laughs> oh, it's time for What Should I Walk? Ah! <gasps> Thank you. Welcome to What Should I Watch? Now you know each other a bit better. You have 45 seconds to guess each other's top three recommendations that are hidden under this question mark. One point for each correct guess. Ready, Ethan? Yes. Your time starts now. Right, okay. So, I know you're a big football fan, so it's definitely gonna be the all or nothing yeah. series, right? You're on the right track. Okay, I believe you're probably friends with KSI, as am I, being like YouTube gentlemen. You can also watch us on a charity version of Bake Off if you're so inclined. You said I you like... wanted to save uh, Elsa's somewhat relative, right? Yep. So that's that. Ooh, are you more of a super bass listener or are you more of a Tom Jones listener? Um, I think you probably like Sky Atlantic 000. The last one, I'm trying to think. Ah, 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 um, ah, uh, uh, uh. Okay, I'm picking suits. I'm complete, I'm done. I think you like Meghan Markle. I'm completely done. I'm happy with my se selections here. Are you happy with yours? Ta-da! Right. Ooh, Bridgerton. You don't seem to. No, I'm just, I'm, not, I'm trying not to give anything away, plus I've had Botox, so you can never tell how I feel. KSI zero zero in suits, ooh, okay. Do you like, are you friends with KSI? I'm really good friends yeah. with KSI, yeah. JJ, as JJ. he's known in the friendship circles, I'm friends with KSI. Are you? Don't pigeonhole me as someone who just follows mommy blogger YouTubers. Bridgerton. It's what household is not watching Bridgerton? I haven't seen it, but I thought you might have seen it. All right, time to reveal. Time to reveal. Three, two, one. Oh my God, I've got it completely wrong. Oh, wow. Oh! You, you got a point. You chose the wrong YouTuber. Fisherman's Life, that surprises me. Why didn't you choose KSI if he's your friend? I see him every day. And then Chernobyl, I knew it. I knew it, but I went zero, zero, zero because I like it. Mm. All right, and look, see your choices. You mentioned Frozen earlier, so I was I close. Did. I I love listening to Cardi B, and do you listen to her? So, like, do you buy into the battle of Cardi B versus Nicki Minaj, and are you backing Cardi's beef? Yes, if it has to be one or the other. And I hate that the Britney and Christina female rivalry yeah. is now spilled over now. It's Cardi and Nicki. They're both winning, right? They're yeah. both winning. They're both excellent. But I like Cardi. We have a similar background. Oh, okay, fair is. Yeah. Nice. We used to be nannies. Oh. Uh, it looks like I chose the wrong Netflix show. Three identical strangers you should have got because I left you a clue in the living room. I had three little models. Were they the little puppet looking fellas on the bookshelf? I don't want to spoil it, but they're triplets who were adopted out to different families. Tell me about Fisherman's Life. This okay. is a swerve. It's a little curveball. Okay. But Fisherman's Life. It's a man, he's got a boat, he's got a kayak, he's good at fishing. Mm. It's so therapeutic. Oh, caught a little lingcod. Oh, oh. nice. Does right, he tell you about his different bait? Yeah, yeah, it's really quite something. I mean, it just surprises me that he's not Canadian because you've described all of my ex-boyfriends. <laughs> Lost many men to fishing. Oh my God. Huh. That buzzer means that's all we got time for today. Oh, well, if you're wondering what should I watch, check out the links in the description below. If you like what you've seen today, make sure to click that like button and subscribe for more episodes. And if you've got SkyQ at home, it's as easy as this. What should I watch?